to the video someone also is saying hey the hairstyle is nice so yes the hairstyle is very nice if in case you want to do this hairstyle yourself go to the description box i have a video there for you click on the link and the video is for you you can also do it yourself i did it myself okay yeah here's the final look of this let me show you guys what can you see go and watch that video you will know everything okay yeah thank you so much i'll see you hey guys so i was recording while filming but my microphone wasn't helping so i have to do voice over i started by moisturizing my lip with this lip gloss you can use any lip gloss of your choice after that i'm cleaning my face with this cucumber face wipe i'm going in again with my tea tree cleanser to clean my face okay yeah one tip here guys anytime you're cleansing your face make sure you start from your forehead okay yeah start from your forehead before you move to your other face okay so i'm going in again with my rose water this is the original rose water okay yeah so i'm cleaning my face with this rose water okay i'm going ahead to use my vitamin c to moisturize my face yeah just tap it in I'm a combination skin, so I feel like moisturizing all over my face. So I'm going ahead to use this primer, HD Brosome Makeup Primer, to prime my face, okay? Just tap it into your skin, okay? okay guys so i'm going ahead to use my glow oil this is the diy glow oil i made it myself okay so in case you want a video of it just comment and let me know okay yeah so i'm going ahead to use it on my my cheekbone my nose the bronze area of my face yeah I'm going with my finger to blend it out. Yes. Okay, so I'm using this orange corrector to correct all the dark, dark black spots over my face. Okay, yeah. I'm going ahead to blend it with my finger first before I use a beauty blender. So let's move to the eyebrows so i'm brushing my eyebrows up brush them up make sure you brush them up okay yes but i feel like using black gel today yes i'm using black gel for this my eyebrows okay yeah I always feel like using the telecom to brush it up because it gives me the stroke effect that I need. Okay, yeah. So you have to go in for what will work for you. Okay, here. Yeah, so we are leaving the eyebrows to make it dry before we come back to it again. So we are going straight to our foundation yeah so i'm using real nice foundation number 105 here yeah. just a little bit is enough that's why i like this foundation it's a full coverage 
just a little bit is enough for your face okay yeah so i'm going ahead to blend it with this of my brush before i go in with my sponge okay yeah so watch me as i do blend 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 So I'm going ahead to use my MAC foundation for my highlights. Okay, yeah. So, so. Make sure you blend everything up, okay? Yeah, make sure you blend it up. Let's blend. Okay, so I'm going ahead to use my Benai Banana Powder to set my highlighted area of my face. I'm going ahead to use this lipstick as my blush, okay? Okay, so we are going straight to the baking. I'm using this RCM No Color Powder to bake my face, my under eyes, my nose, and my forehead. Okay, so let's move back to the eyebrows okay yeah make sure you draw the eyebrows the cave everything very neat i have a tutorial of my eyebrows on this channel so you can go ahead and check it out thank you I'm going here with my pro concealer to conceal my eyebrows and I'm using a Vita Joseph concealer brush to conceal my eyebrows Okay, so let's go straight to the eyeshadow. We are using this eyeshadow palette. Yes, yeah, so I'm going ahead to use this nude one. So I applied these two eyeshadow on my eyelid, blended with my finger, okay? Yeah. So 
so i went ahead again to use this brush to blend the outer corner of my lid my eyelid okay yeah, yeah. so i'm going to use this eyelashes it's from snow kiss okay yeah to use it i first measure my eye with the eyelash i trim it a little bit i use bonding glue for my eyelashes you can go ahead and use any glue of your choice okay yeah so i glue them i came back to my under lid i blended it with the eyeshadow the nude one i first used okay so i'm going ahead to use my white pencil for my waterline okay so it's time for eyeliner so i lined my eyes and waiting for the eyelashes okay yeah so let's go ahead So I went ahead to use my MAC Studio Powder NW55 to blend over my face. Okay, yeah. I went ahead to use this bronzer. Yes, just to make it a little bit nice. I like bronzer because it makes your face glitter and nice. Okay, yeah. So... by worth i desire your worst so you can just hide while i work i ain't tired you first i'll write a second third verse about the lies you go disperse you never did i know it hurts but something deep inside won't let 